Hello guys and welcome to the next lecture where I will introduce you to double bulls and double bears candlestick patterns. Both of these patterns consist of two consecutive candles of the same color real bodies. The key point that you need to remember is that the second candle must close at a higher high compared to the first candle's closing price. The double bulls pattern marks an end to the downtrend and is a signal that buyers are entering in large numbers hence changing the sentiment from bearish to bullish. While the first bullish candle signaled the possible reversal, the higher closing price of the second candle confirms the change in trend of the market. On the other hand, a double bear pattern terminates an uptrend as sellers enter in large number. The second candle in a double bear pattern must have a lower low for closing price when compared to first candle's closing price. Both of these candles must be of the bearish color, hence confirming the selling pressure in the market. Guys, another thing that I want you to remember while looking for a double bulls or double bears pattern is that you will not invalidate these patterns if there is an inside candle between the two candles. An inside candle is defined as a candle which fails to go past the high or low of the previous candle. I will explain you more about this candle once we get to the examples in this lecture. The only thing you need to remember is that if there is an inside candle after the first bullish candle in a double bulls pattern or vice versa, you will ignore the inside candle and continue studying the next or the third candle to validate a double bulls or double bears pattern. Let us study a typical double bulls and double bears pattern using an illustration. So guys, while trading double bulls and double bears, you will keep the following guidelines in your mind. Whether these patterns appeared after a clear uptrend or downtrend respectively. This means that the importance of the pattern increases when they appear after clearly defined trends. Whether these patterns are also associated to key support and resistance zones on your trading charts. If this happens, you are able to trade these patterns with increased confidence. Now let's understand these patterns using real examples. In the first example, we are looking at US dollar and Swiss franc for XPR to study the double bulls pattern. According to the guidelines we studied, you can see that the market was in a clear downtrend. And then market posts a double bull formation. Notice here that double bulls do not relate to any of the previous candlestick patterns we have studied in this course. While the first candle signaled a possible trend reversal, second candle confirmed it with a higher close. And then the price rallied sharply in an uptrend on this forex pair before a shooting star appeared near this major resistance. Also guys, this is another double bulls pattern here on this chart. While the first candle was a small bullish candle, the second candle was a strong candle with closing price clearly above the first candle in this pattern. The significance of the double bull pattern too increases with the fact that it was seen at a major support here. And look how strong bearish engulfing pattern reversed the trend after a sharp price advance. Now let's look at another example to study double bulls. On this crude oil chart, price was once again in a prolonged downtrend before a double bulls pattern changed the sentiment from bearish to bullish. Please carefully study the second bullish candle as this is an inside candle. So this candle is not considered as the second candle in double bulls pattern here. This is because it failed to go past the high and low of the previous candle. Therefore, in such cases, you will analyze the next candle to validate your patterns. Here it was the third candle which posted a higher high confirming the double bulls formation. 
and once again price advanced sharply in an upward trend. In the next example of US dollar and Canadian dollar, a double bulls formation appeared just below the support zone after a clear downtrend. And a sharp rally followed the double bulls formation. Now let's study double bears formation through some examples. We are looking at pound and Swiss franc forex chart and consecutive double bears formation was seen in the recent price movement on the resistance zones. Notice how similar the double bears were to each other and price fell sharply from resistance zone to support zone on this pair. Finally, the last example is of US dollar and Japanese yen. Once again, after a prolonged uptrend in terms of price and time, a double bears formation brought a sharp decline on this pair, as you see here. And this major decline terminated once a bullish engulfing pattern appeared later. So guys, this also concludes this lecture and I will see you in the next lecture where we will study the remaining two of the candlestick patterns for this strategy.